This is Greg. Today I'm going to work on seat belts for my 1969 Camaro. I've got almost a complete set, but uh, two of these belts are missing the uh, plastic covers. So the only ones that I have are black, but I've got the uh, SEM paint that is for painting plastic that I'm going to go ahead and remove these black ones from these belts and paint them and put them on these two belts so that I have a complete set for the lap belts, shoulder belts, and then all the uh, back seat belts. So the first thing I'm going to do is remove this black buckle cover from this seat belt. And in order to do that, we're going to use a heat gun to heat up the sides so uh, the plastic doesn't crack and using screwdrivers, um, pry it open a little bit to get it past the, uh, the little tab that holds it in. All right, so using the heat gun, and heat up the sides. And start to pry where the tabs are. It'll be a little hot, but you got to move it to keep it from getting too hot. screwdriver in here you can pop it out. So you have it out in one piece and you can also remove this center little uh, emblem and they sell these reproductions you can replace them but I'm just going to use what I've got. So I got these two pulled off of the black seat belts. So these are the two that I'm going to use. And um, I'm going to go ahead and prep them by sp spraying them with this prep spray that's uh, plastic and leather prep. And uh, this does pretty good for cleaning them up, but also uh, makes the paint adhere a little better. And this is the paint I was talking about. Sim Clear Coat. This blue here matches the interior pieces that you use on uh, stuff like hard plastic pieces. It matches really well. So that's what I'm going to be using to uh, clean these up and paint them. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and clean these up with a prep spray. Let's get all the grease and oil and everything off, prepare them for paint. And 
put our first coat of paint on these. Go ahead and let those dry. Okay, these dried up. They look pretty good. So we'll go ahead and put them back on the buckles. So you just wanna put that button in there like that. And you'll see that there's two like tabs back here. And that's where you wanna insert the buckle into and you just pop them on There we go. 